Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In here we talk about motherhood, homeschool, and lifestyle. I have an eight-year-old boy, and today I want to bring you a flip through our science program. So I hope you enjoy it. Stay tuned. Okay guys, so here I have the books that I show you in the previous video that I was going to use to give science to my child and the first one is this one here is science this is from Harcourt School Publishers and I received these books free so I decided to take advantage of them this one in particular uh, I forgot completely the past year and we didn't use it so I want to use it now just from pick and choose from this one as you can see inside it's in, in a very good condition and this is second grade you can pause and screenshot Physical science, energy for living, forces and motion. Talk about sound, earth and science, exploring earth surface, natural resources, weather, the solar system, life and science, living and non-living things, animals, plants, living things and their environments, Ready, set, science. Let me show you how it looks inside. It has a lot of activities for them to do. It has vocabulary. I like that it's color. It has color. And it has a lot of activities for them to do. So from this book, I will just be picking and choose what I think that he finds interesting. Since it is second grade and we had already our science. And we use another uh, book for science. Uh, the past year we used The Good and the Beautiful and with it Marine Biology. I have a little bit of everything in here. Some information here we have the activities we have the it tells the materials that you're going to be using it gives you the vocabulary some tests some reading and it has different themes as well it doesn't concentrate in one in a specific we have as well this other book okay. and it's for practice it includes chapter practice sets science practice test science vocabulary practice and this is grade two those are the contents and this is how it looks inside taking the test i have some explanations in here Chapter one, this is the practice. Give you some tips in here. I like because it has for him to choose the answers. Doesn't have to write that much because we're gonna have a uh, writing curriculum. So I don't want him to be writing uh, so much on the other area so he don't get frustrated or overwhelmed. very little and it gives me the uh, the alternative to test him if I want to do it which I think I will be doing it with some of them not all of them just to see if he's comprehending I'm just passing the pages pretty fast just because I don't want this video to take too long and I have another book to show you 
So this is for the second book. And as I said, this is Harcourt School Publishers. This is for science. This is grade two. And here's where you're going to find the grade. And if you look on the back of this book, grade two, okay? For the third grade, we have this book. It looks very beautiful as well. Here we have physical science, properties of matter, energy, heat, forces of emotion, <laughs> sorry, earth science, we have minerals and rocks, forces that shape the land, the water cycle, conserving resources. Earth and space, we have Earth's place in the solar system, life science, process of life, types of plants, type of types of animals, sorry, where living things are found, living things depend on, on, on one another, and we, here we have the references, and it gives you some information here, it says weekly reader, and this is how it looks inside, it shows the lesson, what are some uh, science inquiry tools, uh, lesson two, what are some science inquiry skills? What is the sci scientific method? And here we have the vocabulary. And this is something I like. I like that it has uh, vocabulary in it. So he keeps expanding his vocabulary. We have some projects and activities that we can do. Some graphics. Reading focus skill, main idea, and details. It's very colorful. I like the features, the images. Make a model using modeling clay. To make a model of a plant or an animal that you are interested in. So it involves a little bit of nature there. <laughs> Some preparation, review and preparation. To check understanding, we have something in here. Write the letter of the best choice, main idea and details. Here we have uh, blanks for the vocabulary so he can practice that vocabulary in here. And I will not be doing each one of these that every lesson has I will pick and choose since we're doing two books getting warmer and this is another activity and if you notice more vocabulary more practicing different types of works and it gives you some information. It has some picture here so they can understand what they are uh, reading or the information that is being explained to them. Another Insta Lab here. This is what I loved about these books. I love that it has a lot of uh, activities and that it has these reviews to make sure that the kid is understanding and comprehending the information that is given. You can choose, you don't have to do the entire page. I can choose vocabulary one day, I can uh, ch try to uh, check on understanding, or I can do the entire page and divide it in two days, or, or you can do it the same day just to see, since some of them are just choosing the answer, so they don't have to actually write that much and that is something that I appreciate a lot because as I said we're going to be learning how to use the dictionary he's going to be learning how to use the dictionary and I think this will be a good practice for him every time he sees a word and we are going to grab the dictionary and look for that definition and compare it to the one they have already in here for them to know so I think that will be a good practice. And this 
is something that I like a lot because we want to study the human body and I think this will be very helpful. We can actually do a unit and uh, get a little bit of uh, each book and put it all together and create a unit, your immune system, and just have a little bit of fun at the same time since learning and having fun can go together. You don't have to do everything boring. I like to do everything in a way that is going to be interesting for him that he's going to have fun because having fun will create that interest for him in that certain topic or lesson or material that you are teaching them you want to attract them by having fun here we have the book the practice book And here it shows the gray, gray three, the third gray. And you can see the activities in here. And these pages has already temptation for you to separate the page if you want to put it in a binder or you can uh, do a little notebook or use a folder and it has already these holes where you can detach the paper and just put whatever is easy for you some graphics here And here we have answer sheets okay guys so I hope this gives you an idea of what you can encounter in these books I think it will work really good for us this is how it looks and here we have used the terms in the box to label the diagram Okay, so as I was saying, I hope this helped you guys. As I said, this was free. Uh, there's a place in Florida where you can get these uh, books free at no cost to you. If you live in Florida, uh, I think the information, if you look on Google, it would show the information. If I find that, I will leave it in the description box. You don't have to spend a lot of money to homeschool. You can homeschool and get the uh, books that you need in order for you to homeschool free. And you should take advantage of, of that. You should take advantage of that because sometimes, especially if you have a kid with learning differences, sometimes you have to purchase a curriculum that will be a little bit of expensive or that something that you cannot just say no to it because if it's something that your kid needs it then you're going to have to spend that money but in these areas like this like science and social studies if you can just save money in those areas uh, of studies I think you should if you have these options available to you you should take advantage of them so I hope these you guys if you like this video please don't forget to hit like comment and subscribe to my channel I see you then bye bye